In a quaint little town lived a cute, playful kitten named Stripey. This delightful little furball was known for his insatiable curiosity and boundless energy. Stripey was always on the move, exploring corners, climbing trees, and chasing butterflies. His days were filled with laughter, play, and countless adventures. But it wasn't all fun and games for Stripey. Watching over him was a wise and caring figure named Nanny McPhee. Nanny McPhee was the epitome of kindness and wisdom. She had a twinkle in her eye, a warm smile, and a heart full of love for Stripey. She was always there to guide him, to care for him, and to ensure he was safe and sound. Stripey, being the playful kitten he was, loved his playtime more than anything. But Nanny McPhee, with her endless wisdom, knew that life was about balance. Stripey was always eager for his playtime, but Nanny McPhee knew there was a time for everything. As the moon took over the sky, it was time for Stripey to go to bed. But our playful little tiger cub had a different plan. He was not ready to call it a night, not just yet. His eyes sparkled with mischief, his tiny paws still itching for more adventure. Just five more minutes, Nanny McPhee, pleaded Stripey, his voice a blend of hope and playfulness. But Nanny McPhee, wise and loving, knew the importance of a good night's sleep. Stripey, bedtime is non-negotiable, she said, her voice firm yet gentle, like a warm blanket on a cold night. Stripey, not one to give up easily, tried to bargain. What about a story, Nanny? One more story and I promise I'll go to bed. He looked at Nanny McPhee with his big pleading eyes. But Nanny McPhee, wise as she was, saw through his little charade. All right, Stripey, one story, but then it's straight to bed, she said, her voice taking on a storytelling rhythm. She began to weave a tale, a magical lullaby of faraway lands and daring adventures. The story, combined with the soft rhythmic melody of her voice, slowly began to work its magic on Stripey. As Nanny McPhee's story unfolded, Stripey's eyes grew heavier. His playful energy began to wane, replaced with a soft, sleepy calm. His eyelids fluttered, fighting the inevitable. His tiny body relaxed, sinking into the soft, plush comfort of his bed. Promise me we'll play again tomorrow, Nanny. <laughs> Stripey's voice was barely a whisper now, a soft sigh carried away by the wind. And Nanny McPhee ever so gently whispered back, I promise, Stripey, tomorrow is another day full of play. And with that promise, Stripey finally gave in. His eyes closed, his tiny heart filled with the contentment of a day well spent, and the anticipation of another day full of fun and adventure. Stripey finally closed his eyes, giving in to the sweet dreams that awaited him. As the sun peeked through the window, Stripey woke up feeling refreshed and ready for a new day of adventures. Stretching out his little paws, he noticed something different. There was a bounce in his step, a twinkle in his eye, and a purr in his heart that was louder than ever. He felt like he could chase all the butterflies in the world. Nanny McPhee, seeing his newfound energy, smiled warmly. Stripey, she said, you see a good night's sleep is like a superpower for little kittens like you. It helps you grow strong and healthy. It keeps your mind sharp and your heart happy, and it fills you with energy for all the exciting adventures that await you. Stripey listened carefully his eyes wide with wonder. He felt a new appreciation for bedtime. It wasn't a punishment, but a magical time that prepared him for the joys of a new day. Stripey learned that bedtime wasn't a punishment, but a way to recharge for more fun the next day. From that day forward, Stripey never resisted bedtime. Instead, our little striped friends started to cherish these tranquil moments. Bedtime wasn't a foe anymore, but a trusted ally. The night sky, once a signal to end his playtime, now promised a time of rest and dreams. Stripey began to understand that each day was like a big exciting book and bedtime was simply turning the page, ready for the story of tomorrow. He realized that the moon and stars were not there to end his fun, but to watch over him while he recharged for another day filled with laughter and adventure. With a grateful purr, Stripey thanked Nanny McPhee, his wise and loving nanny. She had taught him that rest was not a punishment, but a gift. A gift that prepared him for the wonders of a brand new day. And so Stripey learned that every day has its end, and every end is just a new beginning.